Hey, my name is Felipe Andreoli, and I'm here today to talk about the GT1B from Boss. Boss invited me to create 10 presets for the GT1B, and I tried to make these presets like real life presets, sounds that I could really use in a day-to-day -day situation. The first sound I created is a very simple, clean sound, which I call tight and bright. It has a very significant limiting to it, like it's very used for the slap guys, the very bright sound, so it stands out when you slap. So take a listen. And besides all the controls you have of preamp and limiting compression, many effects, delay, reverb, etc., you have also a control pedal, which is control one which is built in the pedal and you can have external controls as well. And you have an expression pedal. And for each patch, I did something with the control and the expression pedal. In this case, my expression pedal is a Wawa and you have a variety of Wawas to choose from. So listen. <laughs> and the control one switch gives me a solo boost. My second patch is called Storm of Emotion and it, it's named after Angra song from the latest record, Secret Garden. And in this song, I have a bass intro where I use chords and I have chorus, delay and a little reverb which you can switch in and out via the control one switch. So listen. My next patch, it's called Not That Mean. It means that it's a distortion, right? It's an overdrive actually, but not so strong. Something that you could emulate like a vintage amp or something like this. And it's the sound that I use most of the time in Angra and many other projects because it's a very subtle drive, but it makes the bass cut through the mix much better. So here it is. The control one switch in this patch gives me an extra EQ to make it rounder and a little more bright, but you can switch it off if you want to. And also in this patch you have a Wawa. The next one is called Reso Octave, and that's exactly what it is. It's a resonance with an octave. And the fun thing about it is that you can control the resonance with the expression pedal. The control one gives me an overdrive to play with this patch. The next one is a very simple patch, it's simply an auto wah with a preamp. <laughs> With the control one switch, you can disable the preamp. The 
The next patch is round and loose, and I try to make, make it sound like a vintage bass with much less highs, a lot more bottom, a lot more definition, so you can play like slower songs, ballads, grooves, etc. With the control one switch, you can activate the reverb. And of course, you also have the wah-wah. I call the next patch Airbender, and the reason is it's a very bright patch, and you have the bend a pitch with the pedal, which is pretty cool. And I added another octave with the control one switch, which you can turn off if you want to. In this next preset, I try to emulate what it would sound like for a bass and a guitar to solo and double a phrase together, for example. In the control one switch, I have a phaser. The next one is called Slow Ambience, and I really like this one because it's easy to play with chords and create very large ambiences and moods that you can improvise over or just play with. There are some very cool tricks with this one. On the control one, I have a delay, which I can deactivate and make the effect a little bit shorter. And of course, you can change the order of every effect inside of the T1B as you like. So in this case, I move the volume pedal before chorus, delay, and reverb. This way, when I mute uh, with the pedal, I'm only muting the signal from the bass, but not the effect, so listen how it sounds.
finally we have the nasty synth and of course it's a synth effect i love synth on bass i think it has a really nice edge to it it's really aggressive sometimes and i try to make this one really aggressive with a lot of distortion as well so listen Now let's try with the wall pedal. So that's it. These are my 10 presets for the GT1B. I hope you enjoy it and see you next time.